Well, hello everyone. This is Richard Kadish, owner and broker in charge of Go Gated Realty, Hilton Head Island and Bluffton, South Carolina. And today is October 29th, 2019 and we're in Bluffton in Sun City, Hilton Head, specifically in the neighborhood of Riverbend, which is the custom home neighborhood of Sun City Hilton Head. We're here at number 189 Cutter Circle, a brand new home, a brand new custom home just purchased by one of my clients for whom I am the buyer's agent. We're going to walk through this home. It's brand new, it's beautiful, with 2,952 square feet, three bedrooms, three and a half bathrooms. As you can see, a covered porch with a traditional low country cottage style. It has a large screen porch out back. And the reason that I'm showing it to you is because as a buyer's agent, I have people who come to me and uh, as with this buyer, we shopped the home and they wanted a new home. They wanted this neighborhood, but other buyers want me to help them to find a building lot. They want me to help them find a builder so they can build on lots they already have. Or if we're working with production builders, well, we go through the whole thing from A to Z, comparing communities, comparing homes, comparing builders. As a buyer's agent, the commission that I earn is already in the price of every listed home and new build. But before we walk through, this home. I want to show you what your annual fee in Sun City Hilton Head buys. And the annual fee, by the way, is $2,220 in Sun City Common and in here in Riverbend. So let's go take a look at some of the different amenities for Sun City Hilton Head and we'll come back and walk through this beautiful house. Riverbend by Del Webb is Sun City's upscale custom home community with its own gated security entrance. Riverbend in Sun City has a beautiful clubhouse for meetings and events, a community swimming pool, and a beautiful pier that goes out into the Okatee River. Enjoy the views from the back porch of the Riverbend Clubhouse. Riverbend has a great pier from the clubhouse to the Okatee River. At Riverbend in Sun City, the pier and floating dock is a great place to enjoy the beauty of the Okatee River. And when you hear people talk about the Okatee section of Bluffton, they mean this, the area that's out along Route 70 next to the Okatee River. Here at low tide, And they're crabbing off the pier. A good place to launch your kayak. And spend the afternoon with some friends. Right at the Riverbend Clubhouse. The swimming pool in Riverbend 
is next to the clubhouse and on the banks of the Okatee River. Included in your annual HOA fee at Sun City are the amenities at the Argent Lakes Amenity Center in Sun City North. In Sun City North they have a beautiful outdoor swimming pool. And a spa. Sun City North has a great indoor heated swimming pool. One of two in Sun City. The other is over at Town Square in Sun City Common. The fitness center at Sun City North has everything you need to stay in shape. The center hall of the clubhouse is large and beautiful where people often meet. There is a concierge. Sun City has over 100 clubs and even more groups and many of them meet in these various rooms and enjoy events right here at the clubhouse at Sun City North. The Golf Pro Shop at the Argent Lakes Golf Course in Sun City North. It's not technically an executive par 3 course, although there are no par 5s. There are three par 4s. The rest are par threes. It's the easiest of the three courses in Sun City. But I understand it's a lot of fun. Now the golf is not included. It is optional and extra to your annual HOA fee. And every golf club needs a golf driving range. And this one has one as well. In Sun City North, they have a dozen pickleball courts. And there are two hard true tennis courts with a dozen more in Sun City Common at Town Square. Town Square in Sun City Common is something like downtown Sun City where we have the Perrysburg Fitness Center, the Yamasee Arts and Crafts Center, and where many of the meeting rooms for clubs and activities and recreational amenities are located. The Perrysburg Fitness Center has indoor swimming, outdoor swimming, a great fitness center, and it's immediately next to the Hard True Tennis Courts and the Bocce Courts. everything you need to stay fit. Where there also is located a beautiful outdoor swimming pool and spa. Here on the stadium court, serve them up one of the 12 hard true tennis courts in Sun City at the Perrysburg Fitness Center. The country club style of play, easy on your feet, and the courts are lighted for night play. Bocce is big and popular in Sun City with eight beautiful courts. Every neighborhood has its own bocce team practicing hard for competition here in Sun City. There are over 100 clubs and groups and here at the Yamasee Art Center in Sun City is where the meeting rooms for many of these clubs are located. Whatever you're into, I'm sure there's a club or a group here for you.
Pinckney Hall is a social building, also the location of the community television station, and in this largest meeting room here to the left, where all the political candidates come and speak during election years, and where the largest groups meet, such as the Eat Right, Stay Well Club, which has over 500 members, and I've been to one of their meetings, and it is outstanding. Magnolia Hall is the community playhouse, the location of live performances and movies. The Hidden Cypress Clubhouse is also the location for Jameson's original Char House restaurant. And this is also where the golf pro shop is for the Hidden Cypress golf course. The Hidden Cypress Clubhouse has golf, formal and informal dining, There's a great fitness center at the Hidden Cypress Clubhouse with views out across the golf course and the driving range. Yes, they play baseball in Sun City. Of course there's a dog park. <laughs> Woodworking and model railroading is so big in Sun City that they have this huge building just for this one group. So we're back at number 189 Cutter Circle here in Riverbend and again my name is Richard Kadish K-A-D-E-S-C-H my company Go Gated Realty like gated communities and I'm the gated community specialist ladies and gentlemen and both Go Gated Realty and Gated Community Specialist are federally registered trademarks. Well, let's just take a quick look around the neighborhood and get a sampling of some of these beautiful homes and the yards with the mature trees right here in Riverbend. Riverbend is the only community within Sun City where you can buy a lot and build the house that you want to build. Sun City is owned by, is a Dell Webb community which is owned by Pulte, so Pulte, Pulte is the the one and only builder for all of the new construction going on today in Sun City North. This is a different neighborhood just off of Route 170 where you can also however take your golf cart and drive on over to all the different clubhouses and amenities that we just saw in our community tour. Let's talk more about this house. You may want me to show you a home which has similar features. Well, we have a seashell concrete driveway with the seashell finish, beautiful brick spacers, hardy plank exterior, which of course is the concrete fiberboard, state of the art for construction today on low country homes and I think just about everywhere. We have the carriage style garage doors and the extra half garage for your golf cart 
lots of people get around this community and those we have four bedrooms with the fourth bedroom up over the garage three and a half bathrooms the covered porch the low country cottage style it's beautiful and we have the vinyl clad windows everything on slab that's generally the way to be let's go in and take a look I think you're gonna like it just inside the front door our line of sight is across the foyer to the open living area with the cascading sliding door, the screen porch, the kitchen area with the one level island, the beautiful dining area at the back, and here in the living room, a gas fireplace, built-ins, and a beautiful coffered ceiling. But we're getting a little bit ahead of ourselves. Let's go back to the foyer. Because immediately off of the foyer, we have a beautiful study or office, den, whatever you like, wainscoting all around the walls with a recessed ceiling. You're going to see beautiful crown molding throughout this house. The ceiling fans are all here. You'll see accented walls with different colors as you see in this room. And our flooring, well, it's luxury vinyl plank. It is extensive here on the first floor. And we also have distinctive light fixtures. The light from the foyer comes right through that front door set, but you also have privacy here in the living room where you have two floor electrical outlets, so important in these contemporary homes when you're floating your furniture away from the walls. The living room open to our kitchen, and we'll go through the various features here. It's a beauty. We have white cabinets, but in the one level island, we have the darker color with the beadboard finish there where the breakfast stools would go. All of it looking good with two pendant lights. Our dining area here to the right is the singular dining area, no wasted space. That's the current trend. We have a beautiful trio of windows large windows that are wood wrapped. You'll see that throughout the house as part of the beautiful woodworking that includes this crown molding which just goes throughout every room. Nonetheless, I'll probably mention it again because that crown molding really completes the house in a beautiful way. Here in the kitchen we have the KitchenAid stainless steel appliances. That's your upper level whirlpool, ladies and gentlemen. And that dishwasher does have a stainless bin. Your double oven configuration just has the microwave at the top, but that's also a convection oven in the KitchenAid product. This home has gas heat, so we also have a gas range. We have some beautiful tile work. We have a contemporary stainless hood. Again, that's the KitchenAid brand. You can see that we have white cabinets which are soft closed with the crown molding. Beautiful quartz on the countertops. Quartz is the upgrade choice of my buyers over granite because it is more stain resistant than granite. The pattern is more consistent than granite. And it's just beautiful. We have the single piece stainless farm sink. 
all of this kitchen open to the living room. It's just a beautiful house, ladies and gentlemen. Stepping out back to our covered screen porch, we have a seashell finished concrete floor. We have a gas stub for your barbecue. We have lots of privacy because of this green hedge right across the back. Our back screen porch has a beadboard ceiling with a beautiful light blue color. Plenty big enough for entertaining and yes it's very quiet here at 189 Cutter Circle in River Bend. And in the primary bedroom we have a trio of big beautiful windows with the interior sculpted mullions, tray ceiling which is another name for a recessed ceiling, your ceiling fans are here, the crown molding is here, our beautiful luxury vinyl plank flooring flows right in to the bedroom here. The primary bedroom has plenty of wall space for your king size bed and a beautiful primary bathroom that's really worth a close look. We have both a beautiful shower and a freestanding tub. The flooring is beautiful with these rectangular pieces of ceramic that look like they are water inspired or blowing sand on the beach inspired. We have a beautiful quartz top with dual basins, undermount porcelain sinks, framed mirrors, everything looking good. We want to take a closer look at this shower. The shower has the zero step entry, a frameless door, the entire enclosure is semi frameless with just the one frame running across the top. Inside we have the beautiful pattern that we have on the floor but with this accent piece, all very cheerful, very tasteful, everything is just a cut above high window for light but privacy, a beautiful niche, really a lot of care for detail ladies and gentlemen. This is artwork in architecture, looking great with a bench. And just off of the primary bathroom is our closet for him and for her. Beautiful traditional shelves, drawers, and hangers. Our luxury vinyl plank is here. And the other half is here. This flows into our laundry with very high quality, continuing with the quartz top, the white cabinets, our luxury vinyl plank, the high-end appliances are included, a bank of cabinets, and this laundry then takes us out into this hallway next to the garage entrance, next to our stairway to the second floor. That little piece of woodworking there is sometimes called a drop zone. We'll go out into the garage in a minute, but let's go upstairs to the fourth bedroom and have a look. Sometimes called a bonus room, we're in the room which is up over our two and a half car garage. As you can see, it has a dormer with a duet of windows facing sidewards, a third window out the front of the house, This room is perfectly fine as a bedroom, our fourth bedroom, because it does have a private bathroom. 
And while it does have a fiberglass tub and shower, it has a beautiful vanity cabinet, a marble top, and some beautiful tile work on the floor. The bonus room or fourth bedroom over the garage has this beautiful walk-in closet. And here is our walk-in access to the attic. Also worth a look for several reasons. The first being that the house has the spray foam insulation. And that's your open or closed cell insulation, which is your best insulator. It's in the roof deck and it keeps the heat out of your attic, which is why then your ceiling doesn't have the fiberglass bats. We have extensive flooring up here for storage and mechanical access. Again, a gas community means that we have a gas air handler and a gas heater. We have a very high volume attic, which is another energy feature. The higher that roof is, farther away from your ceiling, the more comfortable you're going to be inside your house. Our garage is finished with two big windows pointing toward the street. Our garage doors have the windows at the top to bring even more light into this large space. Each of these garage doors has a garage door opener. The floor is enamel coated for beauty and cleaning. It's practical, easier to clean, a lot better looking than just concrete. Your side door takes you out to your service yard where your heat pump is located. There is a wash bin next to that closet, which is just a section of the garage that's been partitioned off. This is a big, beautiful garage, ladies and gentlemen. And this is, of course, our entrance back into the house. Towards the kitchen, this is the way you'll probably come through the house on most days. Parking in the garage and making your way into the house towards the kitchen. On the way, we have a half bathroom, which can also be regarded as a guest bathroom. Convenient to this side of the house. Notice our luxury vinyl plank is everywhere. This house has it all. So to reorient back to the living area with our gas fireplace and our built-in shelves, we're gonna go see bedrooms two and three. As you come into the house, they would be to the right side And this bedroom to the front has a pair of windows, the same quality we've seen elsewhere. Your ceiling fans are in place. Your luxury vinyl plank goes throughout the house. From this view, we can see down the hall to the back bedroom. Let's call it the third bedroom. If we're in the second bedroom, our closet is to the right, and this bathroom connects both to this bedroom and the other. And it's definitely worth a closer look. It has the beautiful cabinet style vanity. It has high baseboards, which we've seen throughout the house as part of this woodworking package, which gives the house so much beauty and warmth. And absolutely a beautiful selection of the floor tile which is contemporary enough to be cool, but not too contemporary to be over the top or trendy. And yes, we have another fabulous shower, which is definitely worth a closer look. And we'll take that closer look right now from the bottom to the top. Beautiful floor. I love the way that this tile setter Builder, designer has mixed their materials to give you a special event every time you enter into the shower. So tasteful. 
I really like the pattern. I like the way they've mixed up their design. Very, very cool. Doesn't get any better than this, folks. And that same bathroom opens to this short hallway, to this back bedroom, with the same quality of the others, with the beautiful windows, the private location, the luxury vinyl plank flows throughout the first floor. We have eight foot high doors. And back to our central living area. So let me give you my contact information and invite you to call or email so that we can get acquainted and I can learn more about what you're looking for. So thank you for touring this home today with me and Sun City generally. And here's how you can reach me. My cell number, 843-684-2933. That's area code 843-684-2933. My email address, rich at gogated.com that's r-i-c-h at g-o-g-a-t-e-d dot com my website is gogated.com well please find me let's work together I'd like to be your agent here in River Bend, Sun City, Bluffton, Hilton Head Island generally I have 44 years of local real estate experience ladies and gentlemen I'm sure I can help you solve problems, shop with confidence, give you advice that you can trust. It just doesn't cost anything more to have a good buyer's agent working for you. So I welcome your questions, your concerns, learning more about the lifestyle that you want. Thank you again for watching. If you like the video, there's more at the Go Gated channel on YouTube. So please subscribe.